Alright, how's it going, guys? It's Mr. Scott Seven. You made it. Good. I saved you again, Davy. Again. So what are you gonna do for me about Haynes, the rest of the FIB, the IAA, and everyone else, huh? History's written by the living, okay? We can pin most of it on Agent Sanchez. I get that story right and the agency and bureau will back off. The problem we need to deal with is Trevor. Trevor? Why? Try Merriweather, Chinese gangsters, general insanity, and so on. I can spin Steve that you're controllable, but not Trevor. Steve. He's our wounded hero right now. I gotta cozy up to him, calm him down. Just get me out. Welcome to another episode of GTA 5. Here's our next mission. So totally need their seaweed salad. Come on, please. Those are so comfortable. Later. You have to get a tuxedo. So that's just all safe. I've paid this guy to drive us. Get in the back. Vinewood Boulevard, the Oriental Theater. Open that champagne, Jimbo. Woohoo! Me and the big dog getting our drink on. Hey, hey, where are you going with that? Woo! My dad's a movie producer! Jimmy, get back down here! Which makes me a movie producer's kid! Jimmy! I'm gonna ride out the next two recessions without ever having to work. And I'm gonna get a sports car and a drug habit before appearing on Reality Rehab Show. And then. I'm gonna sell my story and become really judgmental. And I'm gonna use all the contacts I make in treatment programs to become a producer too. And I'm gonna make even shittier movies than my dad does. Cause I don't care about movies like him. For me, it's just an opportunity thing. Woo, yeah! You see the streets edge losers? Jizzle in the movie fizzle. Hear that, Vinewood? You hear that, Vinewood? Hey, I hear it and I don't like it. We're going to the Oriental Theater on Vinewood Boulevard! Get back down here! And not to, like, gawk at celebrities from behind a barrier. We're actually, like, properly invited! V to the I to the P! Jimmy! Read my neck rolls! Entitled! E. N. T. Uh, titled! Cause I am! Jimmy! Oh, Pop, chill! I'm done spraying this shizzle! Let's take a drink. Jimmy, shut up a second. Hey, Devin, look. I need to say about Molly, man, I'm sorry, but I didn't do it. I told you to slow it down, slick. It was an accident. I was there, but I had nothing to do with it. Sure, yeah, hey. You made a fool out of me, Michael, and that is something I'm not gonna forget. Look, Devin, I said I'm sorry. I feel bad for you. But you don't threaten me, because this movie's happening, all right? So let's just calm down and try to be friends again. Oh, absolutely, Slick. Forgive and forget. Namaste. Check it out. It's a premiere. You know, I'm really proud of you, even though you did make a pretty shitty movie. Oh, thank you, Jim. Where are the girls? Uh, they're at home. You know, they'll uh, express their pride by showing up pretty late. Uh, of course they will. Hi. Thanks, Antonio. Hey. Give me nice oh, and tight. Never... Hey, it's Laszlo on the red carpet of Meltdown. Some big stars, some beautiful dresses. We're gonna see some side boot tonight. Come on. We did it! Solomon! We fucking did it! Fucking A! <laughs> Fuck you, fate! I may be a lecherous old has-been, but I'm a has-been with a premiere at the Oriental Theater on Vinewood Boulevard. I'll see you in there, kid. Hey, thanks. Enjoy the picture, everyone! Mr. Richards, 
Mr. Richards, hi. If I could just bother you for a second. Um, I'm Laszlo from uh, Fame or Shame, um, but I do some acting on the side. I was wondering if... Uh, oh, yeah, of course. You should come see me, kid. I think I got a project that would be perfect for you. Oh, that's fantastic. It's called The Closet. Huh? Really modern stuff. Uh, pervert. <laughs> come on. No, 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 no. Let's go over She's here. lying, okay? I never had surgery. Come on. Milton, Milton, hi. Sorry to bother you. Quick question. Get in here tight. Um, love, love, loved the movie. Oh, thank you so much. I appreciate it. When, when you were that polar bear and you had to eat your baby, I mean, that okay. was... Okay. All right, Jesus Christ. That was emotional. Stick and I just have a hug. Okay. That really affected me. All right, I gotta go. Thank you so much. Excuse me. Excuse me. Come on. Come on, let's get in there. Ah, Laszlo. Oh, shit. Come on, shit dick. <laughs> Where the hell is she? Looks like she stood you up. Hey, hope I'm not too late. I wouldn't miss this for the world. Devin, the fuck are you doing here? Hey, what a movie, huh? Meltdown. Congratulations, Mikey. We did it. Hey, let's get a picture, huh? You, me, the proud producer. Such a pleasure working with you. You see, I was here. Unlike your wife. Seems to be stuck at home. <laughs> you twisted fuck! You're a dead man! Let's go, Jim. Come on. Oh, shit. W what's happening? Where's mom? The girls are in danger. We got to get to the house. You had two minutes. The worst part about it is Michael didn't even actually kill Molly. What happened? I don't know. This rich asshole is pissed off at me because I didn't shit can the movie. And then his lawyer died and, and he just told me he's going to hurt your mom. You killed his lawyer? A and now he's going to kill mom and Tracy? He ain't gonna do anything if I got a say in it. But you fucking killed his lawyer? No, I didn't. It was an accident. I would never do anything to put you in danger. He didn't need you in a fucking plane engine. Danger. Shit. All right. Okay. They'll be fine. They're tough. This is just a movie guy, right? He he's not a gangster or anything. No, he's not a gangster. He's just extremely rich. He says he's got all these connections. I'm sure it's just talk. He actually never done it. She flew in a plane engine. Plane engine, plane engine. Tom. Never thought I'd drive a limo in this game. Shit! What's that car? All right, Jimmy. You gotta hide. I'm gonna find the girls. Be careful, Dad. Just getting ready. Daddy's home, Ooh, you, you ass prick! Screw you! I'm straight <laughs> this a barrel of fun! <gasps> what I'm in with Tracy! We gotta get in there, Michael! He's in there with our girl! Mom, Dad! Stop it! Look, come on! Do something! Help me, Daddy! Fuck you. <gasps> Okay, okay. You two stay here. Keep your heads down. Be safe, baby. Don't you worry about me. Clear the building! No one leave! <laughs> Didn't make actually damn it, but it was a Trevor. Didn't even dare, no. She flew in here. I don't know if you can tell me, but she flew in a fucking plane engine. There's more than one, surely. Frag out! Not yet! Stay put! I don't like this, Michael! Neither do I! I just keep calm! Take him down clean! Daddy? Ooh, I Are love okay? this part! I'm fine, Trace! You just stay down, sweetie! No one's gonna kill you. Daddy's got this. Completely fucking... 
Reloaded at the wrong fucking possible time. Couldn't get a good co couldn't get a good shot on that guy. Fire in the hole! Not yet! Stay put! Standard ordinance! Let's do this! I don't like this, Michael! Neither do I! Just keep calm! Daddy? Come get some! Give me some cover! You They're picked the wrong guy! Daddy! No one's gonna kill you! Daddy's got this! No way, you didn't! Doing the best I can. Can you see me fucking keep clicking to that wall? Fucking hell. Look. What the fuck is this? Get out of here! Hold, chopper! Lay down fire! Bend over him! Ah! Get down! Oh. Yeah, I guess that's that, motherfucker! Him, hold. Close in! Could the Walmart be fucking just Sorry, destroyed? Sucker! Oh. Drop it, prick! So I cleared them out. Fucking hell, man. Controls are being a pure asshole in this place. Uh, I got you, you dick. Uh, it's gonna be all right. <laughs> no, it's not. What was that? Someone there? I'm gonna start shooting. Fuck. <laughs> yeah, you like that, don't you, huh? Take it off! <laughs> Get the fuck off me! Uh, I, I thought I was on that guy! So you sit on his face? It's called teabagging? I really fucked him up good, though, huh? Alright, listen, I'm gonna make a call. It's all gonna be okay. Stay put. Came to my house, Lester. My house. So I asked Amanda and the kids to move out for a few days. I hate to say it, but Merriweather isn't short on excuses to come and kill you. Nor is Devin Weston. I ain't looking for perspective, Lester. They came after my family. All right, all right. I, I don't know what to say. Does this change where you stand on the Union Depository? Hell no. We move on that right away. Before it gets any hotter. Uh, that's smart. Meet me at the strip joint. I'll get word to Frank and Trevor. All right. Wait, we're going to day days? Any planning or anything? Well, we've planned, I think.
shit. Ricky from Life Invader. Bro, I know you'll find this hard to believe, but it's kind of difficult for someone with a middling GPA and bad references to get a job in this climate. You gotta help me. Hey, if there's something, I'll call you. That's all I can say. Good luck out there. not gonna try that again. I'm on top of this, Amanda. Trust me. Really? You're sure? I'm positive. Look, I love you, baby. I'm gonna take care of this. Oh, that was Franklin's color. Mr. Descent, good to see you. Struggling pain, struggling pain. Evil saints in my brain. Hell yeah. They only play like six songs here. It's kind of making me crazy. Hey, sorry I'm late. Oh, we were just talking about you. Well, don't worry. Another few hours, you never have to talk about me again, Trevor. You're the one who likes to talk. Watch your back. You too. That's all I'm saying. Fuck you. Fuck you! All right, excuse all right, all right, me! Enough! Enough! enough. Thank you! <clears throat> okay, uh, this is it. <laughs> well, we have two options. They're both a little, uh... <laughs> out there, but then again, what do you expect? Okay, option one. We hijack their armored cars. We take the crews hostage, and then we infiltrate the depository. Now, once you're in there and you've got the score, we send in a team of modded cars. You load up, you get out. And we need to infiltrate the transportation grid and manipulate it to aid our escape. But option two, we cause a distraction out front, make them think we're dumb. <laughs> well, we've never had a problem convincing people of that, have we? <laughs> The other guys will be drilling, taking what they can. You're gonna be the distraction. Always the attention seeker. You know, for a guy who's always stepping on his friends to get ahead, he has an unfortunately low sense of self-worth. Okay, okay, let me show you the board. To uh, recap, these are our options. We try to make them give us the gold, or we drill a big old hole in the side of the bank and we take it out. If you're drilling a big old hole, you'll need a big old drill, a tunnel bore machine. I'll locate it, but you have to steal it and store it near the bank. Uh, they're excavating a new part of the metro network around there, so that's where you'll go in. Uh, we'll need choppers for the getaway, too. Uh, Trevor has one we can use, the other can be bought. The guys on the ground will need a getaway car, so get something fast and tough, and then modify it as much as you can to increase your chances of getting away from the cops. And it's got to be stored in a parking garage near the UD. Uh, there's going to be a lot of heat, so think about that. Um, or I'm forgetting something. Uh, oh, that's it. <laughs> we'll need a train to land the gold on and take it to the warehouse. You'll have to steal it. Uh, again... I'll send you the details. Now, if you're interested in the more, um, subtle approach, hijacking the armored cars and so on, huh, you've got to get some police stingers. Only cops are licensed to have them, so that's a headache of its own. Oh, what else? Um, oh, right, uh, you'll need to get a hold of and mod some getaway cars. Uh, normal suspension's gonna give out under a couple of tons of gold. Whoa, man, a couple of tons? Four tons in total. <laughs> and that's what I can get the system to divert into the cage we're hitting. Fuck me! 
Okay, okay, last thing. You remember that underpass we saw from the helicopter? Well, that's where I'll set up the uh, smoke and mirrors to get the cops off your scent. I've heard that before. Michael, subtle or obvious, what's it going to be? So? Oh, you want him to give you the medal? Okay, well, it's gonna take a big crew. Uh, two gunmen, two drivers, and a hacker. Wait, Gustavo? Well, he's had my back on every job since I got up and running again. He deserves a shot at the big one. Oh, Chef. It's got a good percentage. And driver number one takes the wheel in the fourth getaway car, is going to be at the bank with you and help loading. They're a key part of this. Driver number two helps you hijack the armored cars and will be in charge of replacing the tires your stingers ripped out. Ah, okay. This one's new blood. I've seen him drive, but I haven't seen him under pressure. Now, the hacker, uh, they're going to break into the traffic system, buy you some time coming out of the bank, if you need it, but we might be cool. Paige, she's a badass. We've been waiting our whole lives for this one. Are you sure you got this right? Okay, we need those stingers and the modified getaway cars. <laughs> I knew you'd like that. Sounds kind of fruity, if you ask me. Nobody asked you. Look, this is our only hope. You control traffic in this town, you control the streets. I think it could work. It will work, as long as we're ready to move now. Come on, I'll take you to the equipment. Fucking asshole. All right, let's go. Sweetheart. Hey, Can somebody get me a sandwich? That's correct. Trace? Daddy! Are you okay? Yeah, sure. Why not? Cause some guys came to our house with automatic weapons, maybe? I'm dealing with that, honey. You don't need to worry. Money doesn't matter when you're dead, Daddy. Anything about the haste yet? There you go, we got one. It's not even that far. It's literally up the road. Damn train. Maybe I should have brought my card in here. in a couple hours. Let's see that new one. The one that just came out. It's about the finance guys. What's it called? Meltdown.
Little does he know he was going to see meltdown when the producer was stealing a police van. Small world. Hey, you hit me. Shit, Mr. Tom. Lester, I got the spike strips we need. Good. Now, once we have all the modified gauntlets, we take the score. I'll get them there when the video. Oh, that's right, you fucking doesn't get uh, it doesn't get away, you have to actually guess. Go for it! Hang on, hang on away, go. It's just an online persona. It was satire or parody or something. I didn't mean it. Jim? You're taking me up Banham Canyon in this charcoal color Landstalker to punish me for trolling you? If only someone would save me. Stall him, kid. I'll be there soon. You know, you, you really are funny and interesting guys. I mean, any attention is uh, good attention, right? See you, Jimmy. Fine, fuck you know. I wonder what Jimmy said for them to like kidnap him. I don't think it's kidnap him, like, but like they've got to teach him a lesson. suspicious of anyone behind us and if there was he would just be there to warn you he would definitely not kill you definitely would not kill you shut up troll you gave up your right to free speech when you insulted a celebrity on the internet it was a couple of comments some colorful language uh it was harassment you're the comedy writer deal with the heckle i blocked you 
You started another account. I blocked you again. You started another. But what you didn't count on is me having the money and the resources to trace your IP. I count on you having better things to do. Well, I don't. I'm a lonely man, and social media is my life. It's given me the recognition I've been denied my whole life. I can make snarky comments and glib pronouncements and lap up the adulation, banishing any form of dissent. I'm a king, and Bleeder is my kingdom. Okay, um, that's pretty sad. Don't lose sleep over it. When I'm done, the only bleeding you'll be doing is actual, like, bleeding, because then you'll be in pain. Me! <laughs> <laughs> that joke's horrendous. Who is that animal? That's my dad, you a-hole. Oh, he's gonna fuck you up properly. Oh, really? How big's this herd, huh? The size of your herd? Don't matter when you're a total badass psycho, you dick. Daddy's boy. Read the tattoo, kid. What's it say? Entitled. Because I am. <sighs> Horrible little troll. Fuck, get away from me! Don't like kill him! You got my son in there! Can you fucking see? Give me back my boy! Try to shoot one of the tiles. Move! Okay, kill him. Try to just take it one of the tiles. Take you home. Thank you. Shit. Fuck, man. You, you think? You think it's over? Yeah, wow, yeah, the back yeah. tires on the Are you sure? Cause the dude holds like a grudge, and I'm like his nemesis. I wouldn't go that far. Look, he thought you were a fat little nobody. Now he thinks you're a fat little nobody with a badass for a dad. He'll stay away. But... But I'm like his troll, Pop. Call me an idiot, but a troll? Jim? What's a troll? Like a joker on the internet. What sort of jokes? Sort of mean jokes. Like what? Like, someone posts something and you're all like, that sucks, you suck, dick. Oh, so jokes that aren't funny. No, you don't get it. The humor comes with repetition. Like, you say it once, big deal. Then you say it again, and again, and again, and again. Okay. Like, the other day, he posts this picture of his newborn, and I'm all like, damn, son, that right there is one ugly-ass motherfucker of a baby. And I'm all like, my balls is prettier than that baby. And then I sent him a picture of my balls. I seen Roadkill prettier than that baby. What the hell is wrong with your baby? And he's all like, actually, there's a problem with its chromosomes or something, and it's actually a miracle it survived birth. And I'm all like, it's actually a miracle I survived seeing a picture of its ugly? Enough! All right? E fucking enough! I get it. Maybe that one was a little OTT, but it's generally really good times. Yeah. Good times. Great times. The fucking fun you have. Alright, the troll could come out of his cage. Screw you. It's sticky back here. It smells funny. Yeah, well, maybe that'll teach you to wind people up on the internet. Now get out of here. 
he's been doing reality shows, but he's really good. Let's go get these calls. Wow, that car knew I was coming, dude. Well, I've got locked in the car, man. I didn't know that. Why are you sure not leaving? I hate you. Didn't you know that? I feel like I really could have picked a much better car. This is where I'm supposed to go. Yeah, guys, it really, it's been really fun playing the series. I feel like it's come, it's come to an end soon. You can tell because after after they get these four cars, it's going to be the big score. So, yeah, I don't know if it's score big scores the last mission. I doubt it, but there'll kind of be many videos left of this. Maybe. Two at my at mystery. What the hell? Where is it? That's it. Oh, by the way, I'm definitely trying this. Storm terrain. I was trying to make it, I think I was just an Oliver. I was just like, whoa.
Nothing, you stole it. Ah, wrong way! There, that looks better. It needs to be these missile cars because it wouldn't hold the gold. I think we're just storing it now. Let's call a cab. Yeah, hey, I need a cab. Uh, unfortunately, we got no cabs available at the moment. Can you try again late? How? Oh, it's seven o'clock. No, I'll see you in the next one. Is. Seriously, we're not going to pick. See a bit here? Somewhere? Come on, get us a cab, it would just be so much quicker. Yeah, I need a cab as soon as you can. No problem. I'll have Thank one there God. in a couple of minutes. Appreciate it. I'm singing in the rain. Hey, Lester. First gauntlet's ready to go. All right, that's good work. I love the rain. Maybe a part of the snow is my favorite weather. So, where do you want to go? Rock. Right next to it, boom. Perfect three point. Thank God that was right next to it because I was far too gonna have to go and look for it. Don't worry for you guys, I would have edited it out, but for me it would have taken forever. Oh, it stopped draining. It stopped draining on that journey. It's pretty sad. Yeah. 
tus ojos. Good as new. It needs the big tiles. Oh okay, guys, that's Scotland number two, and I crashed into the first one. I parked it the other first time. Anyway, for the past. I'm away from it. Second gauntlet's a go, Lest. Good. We only need one more. Oh, we need four? Oh, well, I'll just make sure easier. Okay, and that's in... I think that's about here. Let's have a look at the picture. Well, this one's a bit hard, this one. Sorry guys, sorry guys, I think I see it there. Wait, no. This one's a lot harder. I think it's here. Go for that over the best. I'd like to order a cab, please. Not a problem. A driver's on the way. Sounds good, thanks. I thought I was a cab there, and I thought, fuck, you know, that was quick. Why do you know that efficient in real life? Can I sing singing in the rain Because it's near in. Cab for the Santa! Oh, this just takes me next to the car at the okay, fucking last time. Oh, is that it? Who's telling me that's it? I don't think it is though. Is that it? Oh, it is. Boom. Right next to the same one again. Excellent. I knew I knew I'd go to ring the first time. I just, cause I don't think this one's got a streak. That's why I didn't know.
Thank God for taxis in this game, man. This would take so, so much longer. I'm sorry about that. Yeah, I'm getting the fucking... Getting it repaired anyway. I still don't look for. Draw a blank when the word repaired. There you go, all fixed. Wait, what? Fucking out! Third and final gauntlets, primed and ready. Excellent. I'll let the others know we have everything we need. We'll meet at the strip club. Well, guys, I'm going to end the video there. In the next video, we'll do the heist. I just want to say thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please smash that like button if you want to see more GTA 5. Please don't forget to subscribe. And thanks for watching. And yeah, see ya.